We're now on the final installment of the scrap series, so we're at Reverent, and you may be wondering what is meant by Reverent, so now I'll share a hundred percent of what I think of this final ward in the scout lot, and please don't get bored. Reverent is quite coincidentally something that lines up with today you see, for today is the U.S. National Day of Prayer, and Reverent describes a sincere prayer sayer, but often summed up as religious, Reverent is actually much more than this. It means showing respect that Solomon deep to that which in your heart you sacredly keep, and for some that it may mean following God, even when others think our observance is odd, but it can be directed toward any entity, or even an idea or ideal you respect plenty. We're now on the final installment of the Scrap series, so we're at Reverent, and you may be wondering what is meant by Reverent, so now I'll share 100% of what I think of this final ward in the Scout Law, and please don't get bored. When you think of sanctity, which means having a holy quality, what do you find as being holy? And I don't mean donuts, though they're yummy. Do you hold nature as a, a being a sacred thing, the laws of physics that hold up this, the bird's wing? Is life something you value above all else, more valuable than anything anyone buys or sells? Is love and kindness what you find to be, out of all other attributes, the ones most holy? Are the Holy Bible and the Lord above treated by you with reverent love? Whatever your answer, it's okay with me, as we each must follow the path we see as bringing us to uh, living morally straight on all days at all times, both early and late. And whatever you treat reverently, if it, it leads you to treat all, well, all in humanity, then you fulfilled the oath and laws of scouts, for deep and solemn respect is seen throughout all the points of this uh, scout law rap series, from acts of kindness to daily courtesies. We're now on the final installment of this rap series, so we're at Reverent, and you may be wondering what is meant by Reverent, so now I'll share 100% of what I think of this final ward in the scout law, and please don't get bored. Now we are drawing this to a close, so I'll remind you of all of those points of the Scout Law we've gone through as a rem reminder to each and every one of you. Trustworthy, being one who others can trust. Loyal, doing for friends and more what you must. Helpful, reaching out with acts that show you care. Friendly, being someone who others know will be there. Courteous, showing good manners to others. Kind, treating well fellow human sisters and brothers. Obedient, doing as told but also following your own ideals. Cheerful, spread, uh, spreading smiles around even when faced with bad deals. Thrifty, being wise with resources like money and time. Brave, pushing on even when things are sour as a lime. Clean, being clean of mind and of heart. And last but not least, the final part, a scout is reverent at home and in the tent. Whether they believe in Hashem, Mother Nature, Christ Allah, or the Tao, a scout has solemn respect in the here and the now. We're now ending the final installment of this rap series now that we reached Reverent, and I hope you know more of what is meant by the Scout Law, our Scouting Testament, and of what I think of each and every ward in the Scout Law, and I hope you didn't get bored.